Now to a story you saw first on Click2Houston.com. Prominent Houston attorney and mayoral candidate Tony Busby's River Oaks home burglarized. He says intruders stole millions in cash, weapons, and art this morning, but he says he managed to scare them off with a gun that wouldn't shoot. The crime happened the same day he was to host his first campaign rally tonight near Rice Military. Our Keith Garvin was there, and he's joining us live now. Keith, did uh, Tony Busby address the break-in tonight? Oh, he did, Bill. It was one of the very first things that he talked about. Crime was one of his political talking points tonight, and because of the ordeal he went through this morning, it was something that he could now talk about from personal experience. I was robbed this morning by two, at least two individuals that came into my home in my private sanctuary. New details provided by Houston attorney and mayoral candidate Tony Busby about a break-in and robbery at his River Oaks home early Monday morning. Busby divulged the new information to a crowd at his first campaign rally near Rice Military. He says the burglary occurred just hours after he hosted a Super Bowl party. This morning at 6 a.m., you may have heard this, I woke up and something didn't seem right in my house. Busby says when he went downstairs, his front door was wide open. When he went to close it, he spotted a man in his front yard, went upstairs to check on his children, grabbed a pistol, and called 911. He says less than 20 minutes later, the most frightening moment came when he and his son came face to face with one of the burglars still in the house in his son's room. That particular individual who was wearing a black hoodie, black, black pants, I told him step back and I, and I was going to fire my weapon at him. Busby says he shared the ordeal not to criticize law enforcement, but to highlight the need to reduce crime in the city he wants to lead. If we can't be safe, in our homes, where can we be safe? Nowhere. Crime has no zip code, and none of us are immune. We better do something about the crime in this town. And as we mentioned, those thieves were able to get away with millions in cash, weapons, uh, and also art, but thankfully no one was hurt. Crime was just one of the issues that Busby talked about tonight. He also addressed the issues of the need to properly fund a flood control plan, the homeless issue, and also firefighter pay. Reporting live from near Rice Military, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you.